that smoke. All right, give them a little smoke. Look up here, they're all hanging around the top. And we got a little bit hanging there. Let's check for queen. We haven't videotaped one on the inner cover yet, but uh, we will sometime this spring, I guarantee you. Here, scrape it off on the front, we got it. And we're gonna clean this up a little bit, but there's no queen on here, but always, always look. I mean, it's hard to remember to do it, but you want to do it. Hey, look at all that bridge comb they made. Making a mess. So we lost weight. But, yes. and we thought we would have these two frames drawn out and they're not. No. Nope. So that's interesting. And so we had two and a half frames on drawn out after last weekend. And they're just barely touching that. Oh, well, they're getting onto that one now, but there was nothing on it last week during our inspection. They were both empty. And this one here was half drawn out, so let's see what it looks like. Normally I would start from this end, but since that was yep. open, uh, that's why I'm going in this direction. It's about half drawn on this side. <clears throat> Any queen? Any eggs? Yeah, it's all eggs. Amazing. Oh, excellent. There was nothing on it last week. Let's see what the other side brings us. Oh, now there was this is all eggs down very here. little cat brood on this last week. They were just drawing it out on this side. There she is. Yep, and she she's is. over here working. She's a nice, big Caucasian looking queen. Miss Tiger. Wish she would be more energetic. Okay. Yep. Yep, we're gonna flip oh, this yeah. frame because that side's drawn out and this one isn't, and they got fresh brood in there. So we'll we'll uh, just switch that around for them. And that'll encourage them to draw this side out really quick here. Jim can get his fingers out of the way. Oh, that's a good looking frame right there. Look at that. Honey in the corners. So we've got, what do we got now? Half a frame of cat brood. Quarter of frame. This is all cat brood. All capped. So, yeah, we're going to have a crap load of bees into them next week. Okay, let's take that fur comb off. Out on the side, looks like. So a hatch out? Did they relayed? Yeah, she's relayed in there. It's so, all larva. So we got, right now we're sitting at uh, three and a half frames of brood. This is all two larva. Two and a half frames of brood. All larva where, where, she's, where they've emerged from. Okay. <clears throat> mostly capped. So is this one. Boy, this thing is going to explode. It's going to explode. Now, you can, folks, you can see by looking at this, they're on the verge of really having a massive increase in number of bees. 
So giving them the second box like we're going to do today will be advantageous. Though the following week we might have to adjust these frames over here a little bit. But look at that, another frame of cat brood. She didn't get this far back. To... So she has it relayed back, but it looks like it's just hatching. Yeah. Okay. So we got fur comb. Now this yes. is where they're storing their honey. And they're wasting all their energy putting that burr comb in there just to tick us off. Instead of building out their foundation. Their other comb, yeah. That's easy to clean it up. And let's take a look at that frame, see what we got. Oh, honey, I bet. No, nope. brood. Brood, oh, brood. brood on that side. Nice. And what do we got there? No, it's, it's brood. Brood. Well, look what they did with the honey because there was so much space there. Look got what it. they did. Now, did did they gap it on us, or did they just pull it out too far? They just far? pulled it out okay. too far. That's all right. What's that? Oh yeah, pull that frame back up. Oh yeah, shake them. There we go. That's good. Honey, that. But this one is hatching out. Mm -hmm. yeah. They have they have okay honey stores, not massive. Okay, we got brood. Brood, 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 and a half. So one, two, three, four, five, and a half frames of brood. Yeah. Do we want to put that in the middle? I leave it out on the outside, and next week switch it around. Put it in between these two. Separate the brood. Oh, that's fair. Yeah. Right now there's eggs on the outside. Oh, fair. Yeah. Alright. Mm -hmm. Alright. Let's put our set. Oh, yeah, I'll mark the frames. That's right. Okay. Nope. What? It's not, it's not drawn. That's foundation. This is foundation. Oh, oh that's one. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Sorry. That's it. And not, nope. this not, one. That, not that one either. Yeah. <clears throat> okay, let's put that box on. Now let's mark our, what we say, six and a half? Yep. yep. Brood? Yep. When we saw the queen, yep. she was doing her job. Frames of bees was, what, seven? Seven. Seven, yeah. Did we have about a half a frame honey? Yep. Yeah. That's about it. And then we put on the second deep. So if you guys write notes to yourself, you can walk up when you get ready to do the inspection and you can see the comparisons. And once you get into honey super, and this is really critical until you get the honey supering so you know what was happening each week you looked at it. But once we honey super, we don't look at them so often. And so this'll get you to where you wanna be.
That it? That's it.